welcome and thank you for joining us for tonight's Our Daily Bread Evening Meditation. God has given you this moment to slow down and be still before him. Close your eyes and let your head gently sink into your pillow. He is here to receive you, just as you are. As we begin this reflective time, try to get as comfortable as possible. Take some deep, calming breaths. Let go of the events of today as you come to know the presence and peace of your Heavenly Father. Before you were even born, He loved and knew you, and He remains with you for every step of life's path that lies before you. Father God, the Bible teaches that you have set me aside for a time and a place to be a light in this world and to walk in the good works you have prepared. Sometimes this truth brings real encouragement, but sometimes It feels too hard for me. My feet stumble and I falter on the path. Lord, my God, bring me back to my wonderful Saviour tonight who covers me with grace and lifts me every time I fall. Matthew chapter 1 verses 18 to 20 says Mary was pledged to be married to Joseph but before they came together she was found to be pregnant through the Holy Spirit because Joseph her husband was faithful to the law and yet did not want to expose her to public disgrace he had in mind to divorce her quietly. But after he had considered this, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream and said, Joseph, son of David, do not be afraid to take Mary home as your wife, because what is conceived in her is from the Holy Spirit. Imagine being in Joseph's shoes. A jumble of emotions must have raced through his heart as he was told that Mary is already pregnant. The future Joseph had planned for himself and Mary was gone in an instant. When Mary's pregnancy was discovered, Joseph faced an incredibly painful dilemma. Believing she must have been unfaithful to him, he had the lawful right to have her publicly prosecuted. An angry, bitter man might have done this, but not Joseph. However hurt he might have felt, he was compassionate and wanted to be merciful to Mary. He decided on a quiet, private separation. Joseph's actions reveal his desire 
to obey God's word and his desire to show kindness and mercy. Thankfully, as he slept, the Lord peeled back the curtain and revealed that Mary's pregnancy was an unprecedented miracle. She would give birth to the Messiah, Emmanuel. God with us would be the one who could truly unite obedience to the Father and mercy to the needy, bringing salvation and healing to the whole world. The Lord Jesus became obedient, even to death, so that you might know God's mercy every single day and night. Come now and rest in this new life he has won for you. As we turn to prayer, breathe deeply, working out any tension through long, slow exhales. The presence of the Lord is a place of rest and peace. Take a moment to do this breathing exercise to relax your body, refocus your heart and let yourself be filled with the calming presence of our almighty God who promises to hear every word on our lips and in our hearts. So breathe in. And out. And in. And out. And in. And out. Let's pray. God, I want to walk whatever path you lay before me, even when it looks different to what I thought I wanted. Please help me tonight to trust and obey you with an eager and joyful heart, knowing that I'm covered by your grace. Lord God, give me the courage to relinquish control of my life as I put my faith and hope in you alone. Please use me for more than I ever thought would be possible. In Matthew Chapter 1, verse 24, it says, When Joseph woke up, he did what the angel of the Lord had commanded him and took Mary home as his wife. Let's close in a final prayer. Heavenly Father, you are able to use fragile people to achieve the most extraordinary things. You gave Joseph the strength and faith to help bring the Saviour into the world, to protect him 
and raise him. I have faith that you will do amazing things in my life too, because all the power and strength comes from you, not from me. So I set myself to seek what you are doing and to follow wherever